Hey guys, welcome back to the Midweek Escape Artist. My name is Andre, and today we are going to be talking about the Flextail Tiny Repel. Let's talk about it. So guys, I've had the Flextail Tiny Repel now for a couple of months. I have tested it extensively <laughs> in many, many different sorts of scenarios, battling many different kinds of conditions. And I got to tell you, I'm very, very impressed with it. Um, but, you know, I'm not going to raffle on about it too much. Let's get into the unboxing and I'll show you what you get in the retail package. So guys, this is what you get when you buy this guy. Very, very cute little box. Very cute packaging. This is a hard case as well, which is quite cool. So let me just get the sleeve off. Sorry about the way that it looks. It's been packed and unpacked a couple of times. So let's just get into this little guy. So Flextail Tiny Repel, really nice packaging. I'm a big fan of it. So in the case, what you get is the actual unit itself, a little USB charging cable, and I got myself a little pack of extra pads, and you also get a instruction manual. That's pretty much what comes in the package. I've got to tell you, it's very, very well packed pretty happy with the uh, packaging now I don't like to keep it in the packaging when I'm going camping I'll just take it out chuck a few you know chuck a couple of packs of this in and um, yeah otherwise you've stuck with this little bulky pack which you know it's not exactly great for like lightweight compact camping but uh, let me show you what the actual unit looks like so get some of the stuff out of the way this is the tiny repel from Flextel and it is a wonderful little bit of kit. Um, now I'll run you through a couple of specs. So it weighs 148 grams, so it's not really heavy. It does have a little bit of weight to it, but it's nothing, you, nothing you're gonna notice in your pack, I don't think. So what this is, is this is a very, very efficient dual zone mosquito repellent, all right? It's also a camping lantern and a USB-C power bank. <laughs> it's great. It's very, very cool. I like it a lot. Now, um, this is a 48, 49,000 milliamp hour battery, uh, 4,900 milliamp hour battery. It's got four different levels of illumination. I'll just show you real quick here. So that's level number one. As you can see, it's very nice. It's very, very sort of nice for ambience. Let's step it up. That's level two. As you can see it's a it's a fair bit brighter so this is 100 lumens going up again this is 200 lumens and going up one more time there we go so that's as bright as it's going to go it is a significantly bright little lantern very very cute and i also like that the color temperature is slightly on the warm side so it sort of attracts less things anyway by design which is cool but yeah, very, very nice, and let's turn it off. Now, I have used this on probably nine, 10 or nine, nine or 10 camps now, and it's only run out of battery on me once, and that's because I had both coils going and I had it to the second highest brightness setting. Now, in my opinion, that's very much kind of a torture test for it. It didn't last all night, but I think it died, oh, maybe like an hour before I went to bed. So by that stage, there weren't any bugs around and I didn't really need the lantern for light anymore either. So it was totally fine. Um, yeah, also I've never run out of battery on it. It's a really, really nice little unit. Very, very well made. Now, what I'll do is I'll just show you a comparison with the previous one. So this is the Flextel Max Repel, which I've also had for a while. And if you can see here, I'll show you the size difference between the two. So, you know, there is a bit of a size difference. With a Flextail Tiny Repel, slightly taller, but narrower. This one, slightly shorter, but fatter. Um, so yeah, you know, they, they weigh about the same. But keeping in mind, the Max Repel is only a mosquito repellent. It doesn't have a lantern in it. Um, so, you know, this serves slightly more functions. However, I do feel that this guy is more effective at keeping things away. Now, when I've used this, what I've noticed about it is it doesn't take away everything. So 
to give you an example, if there were 10 mosquitoes around at camp, you turn this guy on to the strongest setting it's got, you'll be left with maybe one, all right? So it doesn't take care of everything, but it does diminish them to a massive extent. Now, on my last camp by the lake, I turned this guy on and maybe like 10 minutes after I turned it on, there were no bugs around me because I had this on the table close to me but two or three feet that way you can see just a, a haze of just midges and mozzies and stuff but they weren't near me so it definitely does work and for that I, I really do like it I think it's great the other cool thing I should mention to you is on the bottom here it's got a, um, a thread mount so you can stick this on you know uh, a pole or whatever else you got or a tripod if you're carrying one the other really cool thing about this is this is magnetized it can just stick to your car or your trailer or whatever you've got you can just stick it on there it's also very useful and it has a hanging hook as well so all of those things together guys i think this is a brilliant little piece of kit um, it's retailing for 49 dollars at the moment here in australia it's about 80 bucks and i do think it's absolutely worth your money um, it's very well made it's uh, it's waterproof it does a couple of different things and like I said I've tested this extensively and I do think it works very very well now if you compare that to like a thermocell which is this huge little sort of piece of kit that you got to like have gas for and it's just a schlep this is so much easier it's a no-brainer and in my opinion one of the essential bits of kits if you are in a climate that does have midges and mosquitoes and all that sort of jazz highly recommend this guy but um, I'm going to keep my testing up with this one. Um, I've got two camps planned next week and I'll, I'm going to a pretty remote sort of place. So I think bugs are going to be an issue. So that'll be the first real torture test for this guy. And if I change my mind, if there's any updates on him, I'll put another video up. But guys, I think it's great. Flexel, you've done, you guys have done a fantastic job with this. Um, and yeah, I really, really, really like it. Now, just one thing I'll say. Flextail um, did send this guy out to me to test, um, but they don't get any input in the video and they don't get to see it before it's published. So these are my thoughts and my thoughts alone. So yeah, Flextail Tiny Repel. This is a wonderful little bit of kit, guys. Really, really nice. And uh, if there's any questions about it, please let us know. Some of the questions I have received on it so far is whether or not the pads are toxic. Now... I don't know how to answer that <laughs> these are mosquito repellent coils so I mean you know yes I'm sure that there is something in here which is not good for you should you eat it or snort it or some other way ingest it short of that I think you'll be fine now I've got these pads here with me if you can see what they look like so these are the uh, Flextail Max pads that I've got from the black package and these are the two blue ones from a previous older Flextail package. So there's a little bit of a difference between them. Um, I don't know if there's an efficiency difference, but in my opinion, they worked just about the same. So yeah, there's that. I, uh, I do think the pads are safe to use. Um, now, like I said, I can't confirm that. I'm not dead and I've used these extensively. I've never felt ill. I've never had any reaction to them. Um, I've had them around my dogs when I'm just at home at a barbecue, so I think we're okay. Um, but if I do find out anything else, I will put it in the comments for you. So yeah, and if you have any comments or questions, pop them down below. And uh, if you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing and giving us a like. It means the world to me. And yeah, guys, thank you so much for joining us. The Flextail Tiny Repel, 5 out of 5, nice bit of kit. And uh, yeah. I'll see you guys for the next one. Cheers.